guys, what's up? My name is Kenise and welcome back to my channel. If it is your first time here, then go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Make sure you turn on your notifications so that you don't miss my uploads. Also, make sure you guys are following me on Instagram at girlishdoc 876 If I know your first time I'm running by one of my videos, then I'm big of a self. <laughs> welcome back to you. Alright guys, so we are on the road again. So today I'm going to be looking at, um, it's called St. Catherine Estate slash Bernard Lodge. I've actually seen it a few times but not in person. This is off Dunby Holding Road. So I'm going to be going there filming and then giving you guys my opinion as always. Daddy's here. Maki John in the building. Yeah. What? by the way if you've seen my phoenix park village video then um it's pretty much on the same road so you get to bernard lodge that st catherine estate before you get to phoenix park village so let's go So people, because we did that chat, I never realized the Marit. It's where the Grace Kennedy is. I can look a bit after you pass the Grace Kennedy, where the big old baked bean is. So it's right across from that. All right. So all of this, I'm assuming, is going to be it. So this should be the one bedroom. Listen to me. People made me feel like this thing was really, really, really small, and it's not. So I'm assuming this is the bedroom window, and that is the entrance to the living room that's the security so this is the living room slash kitchen and it's not bad so the kitchen will be over the summer see when that's the kitchen window oh like the set team was can't hold us right and you back door and then this would be the bathroom. Okay. So you know, one look at, I'm assuming one look at the toilet bowl, sink, and whatever. And one bedroom. This is the bedroom. So you have a window here, window there. Not the most spacious in the world, but I think it's very doable. Like you can fit a bed in here, a mattress in here probably, and um, like a chest or drawer or something. And then this to put a back door. All right. So I, I think this is the studio here. The security had said that's the only one, but I still want to go and kind of like Prips and see what this is like. In there, not set up by door, you know. Oh, so this would be the studio. I think this is not something that should is for viewing clearly. But again, people, it is not as small as you think. Okay. So this would clearly be the living room, bedroom, um, your kitchen, I think, would go over there. So, And this would be the bathroom. Right? So I guess the other bathroom would look like this. Something like this. With like sink. And then toilet. But me and my co-workers were discussing it. And we were saying that if you should put your bed or stuff in here, you can always partition it off. Alright. So I just came from viewing. Oh, yeah, 
anyways i just came from viewing it's really not that much to see so i didn't spend a long time over there but as it's customer for this channel we're gonna sit down and talk up the things and i'm telling the woman to really think about the place and all of that so just to get some things out of the way it is being built by the housing associate the housing agency of jamaica in association with china harbor engineering right so the houses are going to be selling for 5.5 million dollars for the studio apartment and uh, well i don't know if it's apartment per se but for the studio and then 6.6 uh, .6 million dollars for the one bed house right i'm going to include a picture of what the application what they require for the application but i really don't have much information so i'm going to link um two articles down below as well as a housing the housing agency of jamaica i'm going to link their website so you guys feel free to reach out to them because remember men are real estate agents and them type of thing there but just go and look as a regular customer and you know inform inform you guys and all of that all right so when i asked the security when they're gonna start selling he said when that unit is finished the first one that you guys saw me look at because obviously they're gonna stage it and when them stages i'm gonna be surprised i'm gonna tell them the real talk no me i think i want piece of matches box but honest to god people it is not that bad i legit thought it was worse than i saw just now no let, let's let's be real honest yeah it is not the biggest space in the world but if this is the first property that you're going to own that is completely fine oh i had written down what the square footage was and what i have on the paper so the lot size is going to range from 2,400 square feet to 2,800 square feet. And I see it's a starting cost. So I don't know if at some point the prices are going to go up. But it can work with. You understand what I'm saying? It, and I'm saying I want big something. But if you are starting out as a young person, especially if you are a young single person, this is definitely something that you can afford a lot of the houses that are on the market are going into two figures now remember if you watch that my nhg videos and stuff if you haven't i'm gonna link it down below remember the limit the loan limit for nhg is 6.5 million dollars and me and you know say me you and daddy know say you can't find us on the market for them the prices so this honestly is unheard of and if for me like you mood are running upon it yeah so like i said if it's a studio it's a 5.5 million dollar and nobody watch no face for that you can afford or that you can afford and nobody make nobody make you feel no way say at this you're living now just a lot of this you live yeah your name is on a piece of title and who can say that not a lot of persons can say that right also the one bedroom let me say you know that but i swear to you i'm walking and i say oh you know so bad because me genuinely feel like i did one matches box based on what i was seeing on the internet but like i said it is quite doable and the greatest thing you can always add on so like i said if you're a single person if you're a young person who's just starting out and contributing then this i think is perfect and obviously it's great for investment as well if you want to buy it and then at some point rent it up but we're gonna need the people and i'm gonna wait for us already i'm just do need for loaders the people who don't have it yeah and if it's a studio if that's what you can afford to start with then work with that and you need for knock down wall if you need for knock down wall and then a bill because a lot of these housing schemes like i went into oh god other day angels angels right when into angels i'm gonna see some big house and then like there's just like one or two houses and if you see where the houses are starting from so listen to me if this is a start on home this can work for you i don't know what go over there run go over there because i don't know if we're gonna find things that is this cheaper and it's because the size it maybe look like the silver sun size at the bedroom i'm gonna be really honest with you so I don't know. I'm not sure what what amenities and all of that is going to be over there, but in terms of affordable housing solutions, we've been saying that there's no affordable housing solutions out there, guys. This is it. The studio is very open, but you can always put a partition and the way off for the one. Are you done? Mm -hmm. All right, guys. One more thing I forgot to mention. Night are coming on, so like the lighting now is terrible. I want to aim. Jesus, 
right so if you have the option of owning this your own home like have the key to your own home versus having to live in somebody else's house listen then this is definitely it because there is no greater feeling i would think than having the keys to your own home than to open somebody else's place because some of them landlord they will get to have truth is not the friendliest and it's not the best to be with and the beauty of it you can add on you can go upstairs you can go to the side but yeah guys th that is my two cents on it um like i said it is not as bad as i thought it was it is quite doable the bathroom is not the biggest in the world yeah but you can you can can work with the bedroom not that big neither can work with because like i said you can always add um and make it be the home that you want it to be so i hope you guys like the content as always make sure you share the video like the video um subscribe to my channel guys you know we're on the road to 1000 so subscribe and make sure to watch the video that mean like don't just subscribe to the channel like you know support local girlish movement also yeah and as always thank you so 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 much for watching if it is not your first time again thanks for the support and all of these things and as always guys tell me what i tell you let me tell you people when me when me go Maki does not work with me this evening. Me don't tell them that! <laughs> Welcome.